Hello everyone, welcome to Good Morning Tarot. Well, it's another day. I'd like to invite you to a short tarot reading and it is a general reading so it is open to all zodiac signs. Just take what resonates with you. At the same time, it is timeless so anytime you find yourself watching the video, the might be a message for you okay so our main energy for today is the nine of wands well it seems that you've just had uh, a certain challenge okay it's like uh, this is like a wounded warrior somebody who has uh, just had an experience of skirmishes or challenges in life and uh in one way or another you were wounded in the in the challenge so somehow uh, you were hurt in the process so for some of you <clears throat> you've encountered a certain challenge it can be in a relationship or with in work whatever it is and uh, you were hurt in one way or another you were hurt in that process and you are a little bit guarded right now uh, Yes, you you somehow have your boundaries a little bit uh, more than you usually have. So you're you're sort of like on red alert. <laughs> uh, you're a little bit more guarded than usual at this time. Now try to see how this one resonates with you. Now how will this and how will this unfold? Okay, <clears throat> well. Yeah, we have here the Queen of Wands. The Queen of Wands is somebody who seems to be not affected. Who somebody who's used to yeah having uh, challenges in in her life, and she's not afraid to be herself. She's not afraid also to assert herself, and she is on fire. So I feel that yeah, she has very good boundaries also, and she's very intuitive. So in a certain sense. Yeah, you have that capacity to size people up. I think that is more of the boundary that you have right now. You are more careful of the people you are interacting with at this present time. You, Before you interact with them, you use your intuition and you try to size up these people. So I feel, yeah, you're not afraid to assert yourself, but at the same time also, you are quite guarded right now and uh, you don't immediately allow people to enter uh, it's you see here the the cat it's as if the cat is guarding the queen i feel that at this present time you are use, using your intuition as part of your uh, defenses or part of your boundaries you have that energy of sizing people up before you interact with them so i feel you are a little bit distant at this time uh, you're a little bit protective of your private space now try to see why try to see how it resonates you are a little bit guarded something has hurt you and you are a little bit it's as if yeah you anticipate that some people might not have good intentions and you're a little bit guarded right now but still you continue to be on fire you still continue on doing what you feel you need to do but yes you are guarded right now now what is advice of the universe for you well it's as if we have here the eight of cups it's as if the universe is telling or this card is telling us maybe it's time for you to leave behind those things that in your life right now that do not make you happy those things that uh, makes you feel guarded always those things that don't give you the peace that you deserve so it's time for you to let go of relationships that are not beneficial to you even working situations even life situations that no longer spark joy okay no longer give you happiness instead makes you feel guarded makes you feel uneasy things that 
yeah, do that, that rob you of your peace within. So somehow the advice of the universe is, yeah, in a certain sense, it's like also decluttering, removing things in your life that do not give you peace, that makes you feel insecure, things that keep you from being on fire and always being guarded. So in a certain sense, uh, let go of those things that makes you feel insecure so that you, you'll be more comfortable. And there's something about uh, spending more time with nature. I think right now you are more drawn to being alone, uh, using your intuition, listening to the guidance of the universe at this time. So this is what you can see in your tarot reading. Now, uh, you prefer more to be alone, you are a little bit guarded, and it seems there are certain aspects in your life that you need to let go of right now. Now, I am being inspired to add one more card. Let's try to see. Okay, don't worry. I think the universe will be helping you. Help is on the way. They will set you free from whatever these situations that makes you feel insecure, guarded. Uh, the universe is on the way to help you and they will set you free. So just be patient. Uh, yeah, continue to have that boundary. And at the same time, I think you know what are those things that no longer make you happy. And it's as if it's time for you to set yourself free. The judgment cards is somebody who is being set free from a very confining situation. So if you are in a life situation that is very confining, I think the message is for you to leave it behind, to walk away, let it go. I think you are a very responsible person. You have your affairs in order. Now there is only one thing that is left. To let it go and start a newer chapter that will give you more freedom, more peace and more happiness. So you can free yourself from this one. You can walk away. You can go to another place where you don't have to constantly guard yourself. Where you don't have to guard yourself each day. You can re take yourself away from such a situation and regain the peace and the fire of the Queen of Wands. Well, that's it for our tarot reading for today. I hope it somehow resonated with your present life situation <clears throat> and has given you the insights you need to make a decision or to move forward. Well, let's go to the next part, which is the self-care. For our self-care tip, we have here uh, from the Affirmator's Cards, the card entitled Playfulness. I am a playful participant in life, and I always have the option to make something a fun game rather than a heavy burden. Mary Poppins puts sugar in the medicine for a reason. That lady really knows how to party. Okay. Well, our tarot reading card shows us uh, that uh, somehow there is something that makes your spirit low, uh, something that makes you feel insecure, something that has hurt you, something that robs you of your energy. And somehow the reading also uh, advises us to let go of these things and to set ourselves free. We had here the eight of cups and also the uh, the judgment part wherein everybody is set free so somehow the invitation for us is to let go of anything that that uh, that puts our spirit down anything that makes us feel insecure and I think the self-care tip advises at us with what to replace it with and that is playfulness replace it with something positive one of the best way to counter something that is negative is to give the opposite which is do something positive and one positive thing that we can do is to be playful 
to just enjoy the moment, not to be too serious, to allow ourselves to be open to commit mistakes, uh, to just celebrate the present moment. Uh, it's good when you do things and you're not afraid to commit mistakes and when you commit mistakes you are able to laugh with it or laugh at it with your friends and uh, afterwards you are able to begin again it's nice to have that kind of thing because that energy of playfulness is you are not afraid to experiment you are not afraid to try one thing and if it fails you try another one uh, somehow that's the uh, that's the energy that I can think of when I think of the word playfulness. You are given the freedom to experiment on many things in order to discover which is applicable in your life. So when you do that, you are also open to committing mistakes. And from that mistakes, you learn new things, new doors open. So somehow I feel this is something that is a very good counterbalance to the situation that the tarot card is painting before us we're in uh, from a situation of insecurity a situation of pain a situation of uh, being robbed of our peace we replace it by nurturing ourselves and just living the present moment celebrating the present moment and i think it's a very beautiful uh, solution to whatever challenge is robbing you of your uh, fire at this present time so uh, i feel that the self-care tip is a good advice be playful just celebrate the present moment don't be afraid to commit mistakes laugh at your mistakes learn from it and then try another one okay try again and just celebrate life uh, we are all meant to we are placed here in this earth not to be miserable but to celebrate the unfolding of creation to celebrate the unraveling of the mysteries of life to celebrate the joy of learning new things each day well that's it for our good morning tarot and uh, thank you for the likes and comments you've given to the channel thank you for subscribing uh, thank you also for getting in touch with me it makes me feel that we are slowly developing a family, not just viewers, but a family, a soul family, a soul tribe. I hope to see you again soon. Until that time, may God continue to bless your ways.